Well, good morning, everybody. As most of you know that follow me and have subscribed to my channel, I'm going to Sturgis, taking off tomorrow, and uh, bikes all packed up. You've seen that video, so uh, it's going to be quite an adventure. Well, this is the route we're thinking on going. Well, we've gone about 110 miles since our last gas stop. We decided we'd stop here and stretch our legs. I did some really good filming, I think, with the GoPro. And then I took it off my helmet and looked, and a big old bug had splattered right in the middle of it. So I don't know what we got there. You'll know by the time you see this. I thought you might be interested in the rafters. And I mean rafters as in floaters, not rafters and as in birds. Jackson, Montana. Jackson, Montana. <laughs> and we had to park about a half, a, about a block away from where we wanted to go, but at least we're here. Yeah, it's a nice cruiser. Now we're in Jackson Hole at the wonderful Cowboy Bar. Going to have something to eat here. The silver dollars in there. Yeah. That's cool. You can't get them out though. They got them in there pretty good. I just told him about my YouTube channel. Oh, okay. So you guys want to be on YouTube? Well, heck yeah. Okay, well, where are you from? Where are you going? Where have you been? We have been in Jackson Hole, Wyoming for a mortgage loan officer's uh, retreat. She was. I have. He's been here I'm to play. I'm on vacation. She's on work. Well, working. then we don't even want to talk to her. She's a worker. No, but I'm ready to play now. I'm ready to play now. And you're from um, Tennessee. Tennessee. And your names are? Earl and Kelly. Earl and Earl and Kelly. Glad to meet you guys. Thanks for coming. We are Harley Riders too, by the way. You pardon? You, I said we, we are drive. Harley Riders too. Both drive. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah. Well, we stopped at Jackson Hole, as you can see back there. Now we've stopped at the edge of Jackson Hole. Fuel up for our second time. And now we still got 220 miles to go, and it's 2 o'clock. I don't know if we'll make that far. We'll try. You'll know in a minute, because it'll probably be on the next clip. We are chasing a storm. And we're not wanting to catch it. We're in Dubois. And you said this storm was just over there at somewhere else and you knew it was there last night? Yep. Where was it last night? Over by the Tetons. Over by the Tetons. So we don't want to go too fast, although we've been going about 20 miles an hour over the speed limit. I haven't, though. I haven't. So. I've been following you, so. Yeah. There we go. Hey. Well, we made it to Thermopolis. You've seen the last video. We uh, stopped at Jackson Hole and had lunch. And since then, uh, the weather changed. We got rained on, got a, oh my goodness, a crosswind like you wouldn't believe. We, uh, uh, it was hot. Uh, but it never was cold, even with we got rained on. We stopped and we'd put our helmets on or a jacket on or whatever and never got real hot. Well, those 
guy's gonna go fill up, and I wanted to show you where we ate. Pretty good food. Real good food, really. Okay, where are we? <laughs> and you're here. <laughs> <laughs> <I> wish. <laughs> Tell us where we're at. The Las Fuentes in Thermopolis, Wyoming. And you're our waitress. Missy. Missy, or our server. Server. Yes. Whatever. Where are we? That girl. You're, you're that girl. Witch, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it happens. Pretty good food. <laughs> Thank Look, you. I, I dove, dove into it. I once again didn't know what I was ordering. And there it is, and it's good. Thank you very much, Enjoy. Missy. Come visit us. Well, the sun is coming up and we're packing up. But I wanted to show you all these, this chamois right here, this body chamois. My buddy over there bent over the yellow tent. He's the one that bought it for me. He's a good old boy. This thing, I got up early, like you said, like I told you, took a shower. It's dry. It's going to be packed up. And it sucks the water off. I mean, you lay it on it, you don't rub it. It's just, it's just a chamois. You know how chamois work. It worked great. This thing actually worked good. I was griping about how cheap it is. And uh, I made my own thing to mount it on here. But, uh, this is for uh, your telephone. I just adapted it and glued something on the back here to hold it on. Then I put the rubber band on there because, man, you hit a bump, it's fly off. But it charged all day yesterday. It charged my phone up last night perfectly. And uh, so, I'm pretty pleased with all this. Good morning, Willie. <laughs> he said some cat killed something. I mean, some bird killed something last night. Flew over the top of us with the cat still squalling. Well, <laughs> did you hear that? You hear that? I didn't hear it. I was out. What'd you, what happened? The bird took off with the cat and his claws, apparently. So they could hear him over the top of the tent, all the way over to the railroad tracks. <laughs> you know what the name of this canyon is? And the other canyon you like? Wood River Canyon. This canyon is north of the Tent Sleep on the way to Buffalo. It is a beautiful ride. I tried to film it on the GoPro. We'll find out. Well, 128 miles from Thermopolis is Buffalo. And that's where we're at. Real quick, we're here at Gillette, Harley Davidson. We just witnessed somebody getting married. 10 years ago, me and my lovely wife got married. That's all I want to say is I love you, dear. Wish you were here. Gillette. Now, guess where we're headed? Yeah, you gotta guess. Well, we're in the town of Moorcraft, and we're going to have some lunch right there at that place, if you can see that. Uh, we spent about an hour and a half, two hours in uh, Gillette. If my buddy was going to buy a bike, and the more he thought about it, the more it really wasn't what he wanted, and the payments were just a little more than he wanted to pay. So, smart move by not doing that. I don't mind wasting the time, because he should get what he wants. For you that have never been to Sturges, I thought I would film this because about at this point when I see that sign, I start getting pretty excited because I know I'm not far from a good time. And if you uh, come to Sturges the second time, you'll get the same feeling. Nothing like the first time because you don't know what you're going to expect. You will from then on. I always have a great time here. We take this first exit from the west and go up to our campsite. You'll see later the road we go on to get up that way. But this will take you down to uh, where we turn off the Deadwood Highway, which is only, geez, four or five blocks, something like that, after you turn off the freeway. Then we follow it back up in there to Hog Heaven Campground. But this is just, this just makes you feel good when you watch this. And when you're there, it makes you feel better. Hope you get an idea of what it's like going down the freeway to Sturgis, South Dakota. The biggest and best rally in the world.
Well, there's the showers. Yes, we're at Hog Heaven. Sturgis, South Dakota. Uh, about what time do we get in here? Four? Something like that. We're all set up, except for Spanky. He's still trying to drive a stake into a rock. But I told everybody this is where we'd be. And by gosh, this is where we be. Especially after the day, I've been out here all Okay, do you want to tell me off camera? What are they doing? Uh, this is the flat track races, and it's the BDTRA. And they have brought all the, the vintage dirt trackers in and the modern ones. Somewhere. Is these the vintage or the uh, modern? I can't tell. I can't see. I think these are the modern. Ah, my, yes, my good cousin. My cousin built the vintage to go everything. began with Pappy and Pearl Hoyle and uh, they started getting friends together and it eventually grew into the Sturgis Rally as we know it today. So this is the original place it began and we have a lot of things for sale here, t-shirts. That's pretty cheap for Sturgis. The original uh, Sturgis patches and pins. I think I'm going to get one of those. You got lots of them though? Yes, we do. Okay. Plenty. I'm going to get me... I'm, uh, I don't know which one I'm going to get. There's so many. Okay. Well, anyway, thank you for uh, telling me all about it. Yeah, you bet. Thank you. Well, you know how this works. I can only record 15 seconds because there's music playing. So we're at the liquor store. Yes, we are. Right there's the liquor store. Okay, now, you're uh, one of my followers, subscribers? Yes, sir, I am. And where are you from? I'm from Canada, but I originally come from Scotland. That's why you talk funny. That's right, yeah. <laughs> How long are you here for? Uh, six days. Six days? Yeah, I'm seated in Kathmandu. Never heard of that one. I said, I think it's kind of new one. Is it? Yeah. Well, I'm really glad to meet you. I'm you, Gary. Keep up the good work. Thank you very much. videos coming. I will. Thank you. Yeah, that way. Thank you, sir. Yeah. seen downtown Sturgis on the first opening night. This is it. I can film now because the music's gone. As you've seen in the last little clip there, that guy was from Canada, been following my channel. Hope to meet a lot more of you guys. Find this, sign in if you want, get your patches, get your official t-shirts right here. This is what the inside of it looks like. I picked out a bright blue t-shirt this time. I got that blue one right up there. Let's see if we can zoom in. Yep, I decided to go with that blue. Getting his back worked on too. There's my thumb, my fingers in the front of the curve. Oh, that's cold. We got rained out. Come in here to get electrocuted. What are you gonna do? Here she goes. Oh shit! <laughs> you haven't done nothing yet. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, I can feel that. Wow! I really feel that. We lost Spanky. He's smoking a cigar somewhere. Hi, hon. How are you? How you doing? Good. Hey, tell me, give me your name. I, I, got a, I got a YouTube channel. You'll be on it. Oh, cool. I'm Dave. This is Willie. Willie. Hey, we're Willie. from Florida. Florida. Mickey Mouse. Where, where out in Florida? Orlando. Uh, okay. I got a friend in uh, Old Chacha. Old Chacha. Ocala. 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 Yeah, he's a good friend. That's All right. awesome. Hey, Bye, friend. <laughs> hey. Okay. Oh, I like that better. Oh, there's cooler over there. Getting old, I like hard work better. 
T-shirt people. This is the best place to buy them, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Two yeah, for 25, have, you can't beat yeah. that. Yeah, we have the oldest uh, annual design in Sturgis. You got a what? We have the oldest annual design in Sturgis. We beat out Tom's Tees by two years. So they started in 85, we started in 83. The rainstorm started, but worse than the rain was the wind. It was. I've never seen it blow that hard downtown. It was blowing uh, banners tied to metal dividers like if they were on skateboards. They almost hit my bike about two foot away. It fell over. So we uh, headed out of town even though the bars were trying to get everybody to stay in town because uh, of the weather, they said. Of course, if they stayed in the bars, they would drink more too. That might have had something to do with it. I don't know. But as you could see, a lot of people were heading out. I mean, uh, people were trying to hold their stent tanks down. Uh, everything was trying to blow away. Big banners across the street. You've seen pictures of those. They were almost ripping the poles down. But we headed back, and uh, you can see the rain starting to hit us there. And. Uh, this is where we uh, turned off of uh, the Deadwood Highway and we followed on up in here to uh, the turn off to Hog Heaven. It's a gravel road and when it gets wet, you know what gravel and dirt turns into. So we did not want to drive on it. We headed up as fast as we could to our tents and parked for the evening. And where are you from and what's your name? I am from Fort Saskatchewan, Alberta. Oh, and my yeah. name is Sam. Well, oh, hi, Sam. I'm and, glad to uh, meet you. Here, give me a left handed shake because I got a handful of camera. <laughs> Check out the channel. You, you put my name in and anything you want behind it, and I probably got it on there. Okay. Yo, Rafa, it's a pleasure to meet you. It's Sturgis 2018. Left handed shake. Right on. <laughs> He's out. <laughs> and you? Tammy from Omaha. Tammy from Omaha? Yep. You sound like you're from Omaha. Yeah. I am. <laughs> you got a YouTube channel? No. No. And what uh, was your name? <laughs> on YouTube. Oh, Dougie Fresh. Dougie, Dougie Fresh. Fresh. Yeah, Dougie search Fresh. Uh, Dark Side Tire Spearfish Canyon. Spearfish and you can Canyon. go through all my other videos. Well, check him out, everybody. All right. That's a, that's a hey. few of the great people at Sturgis in 2018. Go. Well, it's Saturday, second full day of the rally. This is what hog heaven looks like today. Got an awful lot of people. Seemed like downtown was way more crowded than usual. Campground, if you compare the other videos that I've taken, there's a lot more people here too. And like I said, only day two. There we go, we're at hog heaven and we're with Chris Cathers from uh, Minneapolis. Yeah, and he's uh, watched a couple of my videos. Yeah, how'd you do the storm with the storm last night? Oh, it was all good. We were already back here, so we just <laughs> yeah, we just took it in. Yeah, just sit sit in a tent or sit under one of these things, hoping they don't blow down. Exactly. 
So what we are you actually hung out at this uh, right up under this awning over here? Yeah, we met were, a couple of guys we from Australia. There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were, I met a guy from uh, the new that was on the channel. I think he was from uh, uh, Scotland. Nice. And uh, he'd moved out here. Yeah, but, we met a couple of Aussies. They shipped their trikes over here that they've been riding for four weeks. They got uh -huh. two to go, heading back to California to ship them back home. And you're from Minnesota. 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 What what town? Uh, Minneapolis. Hey, yeah. <laughs> hey, well, it's glad to meet you. Left-handed. Yeah. You we'll too, see man. you around here. Appreciate it, man. Take care. Well, you sell hats, that's for sure. Yes, sir. And you got all types. Yep. Matter of fact, the one you're wearing there, a head and home American hat makers or best known as voodoo hats. Yes. That's our manufacturer. Oh, really? So, yeah, so this is our first year on Sturgeon uh, in Main Street. I like the bent up look you got there. Thank you. That, he was looking for one of those last year, but we told him we just hit him in the head. It, it worked, it's wire brim. <laughs> is it a, with wire brim in there? Yeah. So you got a wire brim in here, they're lifetime work. No, I meant the way yours is crumpled down like that. Oh, that? No, that's uh, custom. Five years of abuse. Five years old, I had. That one. How do you take care of your hat? Uh, leather conditioner. Uh, same basic stuff you can find anywhere, but what I like is Ryder's Leather Seal. Uh -huh. they're, uh, they're almost always by JP Cycles. Okay. Plus, really pretty girls come over. Let them, let them rub your hat. hat. Can I clean your boots? I'm like, sure. <laughs> well, we're going to go in here and check this out. If it's open yet, hopefully it is. Where are we? Well, you are in the Sturgis Motorcycle Museum. And Sturgis, South Dakota. And when was it started, this museum? In 2003. And you moved down here? We no. just moved into the expansion last week. Thank you. We uh, have about 100 motorcycles. We have our oldest is a 1905 Harley. Wow. Yeah, and we, we have the motorcycle that did the million miles downstairs. Oh, there's a downstairs? Yeah. Is, is there an elevator? Yes. <laughs> no kidding? Yeah. Oh, God, I love this place. <laughs> well, this is an awesome place here. We got t-shirts, hats, and uh, you guys used to be up on the uh, second exit, didn't you? That was before my time. The city gave oh, us... Oh, now you make me feel The city bad. gave <laughs> us this building like 2001 or two. Okay, and then yeah. you've been Which remodeling. is an old post office. Oh, is it? Yeah, with yeah. vault and everything. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right, well, thank you. We're going to look at stuff. Yeah, go look. Uh, he's going to play music, so I'll probably have to cut out the sound here in a minute. It won't, it won't copyright Reveille. You'll be able to put that on. We can edit. Be recording this, Gary. 
Yes, I am. This is how you show respect. Young man there with his hand over his heart. My hand's not over my heart, but my hat is not on my head. Well, we're at Bear Butte State Park. The reason why they call it Bear Butte State Park is because the government took it away from the Indians. But they called it <laughs> something else because it looks like a bear. This is the bear's back, his shoulders, and then his head laying down. Picture that laying down. They call it Bear Butte. Yeah, I see that bear. Yeah. And it is a uh, sacred uh, spiritual place for the local tribes. You're not supposed to be yakking and talking and hooping and hollering up on that ridge, and we won't be. Uh, we're just going up there, and it's also uh, illegal to put ashes anywhere, really. So uh, I wouldn't put ashes up there. We wouldn't have done that, would we? No. No, we wouldn't put nothing up there. We abide by the rules. We always abide by the rules. This is all gone. So uh, now if I was going to leave something here, but it's illegal to do that, this would be where we would leave it if it was if we were going to do that. That'd be a real good spot. That'd be a good spot for it. That'd be a good spot for John. Yeah. But his ashes are gone, guys. Did they go to the wind? Did they go to Mother Earth? I love you, brother. Full throttle hand. This is Caleb Allard. I'm one of the guy bartenders. We got three of us this year. We got Kyle, we got Jason, and it's 78th annual. We're having a freaking blast. It's kind of hot. Day number two out of ten. So yeah. you gotta come swing out to the full throttle. This is the place to be. It's the only place where you got guy bartenders running around like us. And women running around like that. Yeah, there are. Let's go get a picture of those women. We got 30 more seconds. All right, <laughs> Thanks all right. guys. You got it, buddy. We got we got these uh, Budweiser girls, right? Are you a yes. Budweiser girl? Yes. All right. And looking nice. And visitors too, visitors too. Okay guys, we're out of full throttle right now. I'm gonna drop, whoop, drop this online there and get it to you. We got another minute to go on this one. There, uh, it's pretty awesome. We just filmed uh, some people uh, doing some high wire acts. Uh, that's what we're doing today. We went to St. John's place. Uh, what else have we done? Uh, well, we found this. Very, very tall woman right here. Six foot five. She's tall. She's tall. And the boys there. You can tell how tall she is. There's my friend. And there she's towering over us. We're having a good time. Uh, the Motorcycle Museum, you've probably seen the post on that. All this stuff is going to be way longer. These are only trailers for what you're about 
to see. After doing all the walking up the mountain, over to full throttle and everywhere, my leg was hurting. This young lady, I think she's from Idaho. Her name is Chanel number five. She got me a bag of ice, put it on my leg, and made me one heck of a drink. Because y'all know I don't drink much. But I was hurting. So I had a drink. And then I had another drink. I felt pretty good there with her little hands on my icy leg. Well, we can only do this for 15 seconds because of the music. So, YouTube! Perfect videos. And what's your name? Eddie. Eddie. From Minnesota. Ah, Eddie. Eddie from Minnesota. What a great guy. We're going to have a great time. Bye. Yep. <laughs> well, the music quit, so I can actually do some filming. We're sitting here having some dinner, lunch, whatever we're having, we're eating. He had a burger, I had pizza. Her name's Scarlett. Yeah. Well, Scarlett, you are very amazing looking. And we're going to put you on YouTube and make you famous. Woo. Oh, yeah, we got to get that. There he is. because them girls were talking to us and he went hit his bike and he wanted his picture by his bike so we let him have his picture by his bike and then I photobombed his ass <laughs> yeah let's see if uh, John's name is on here we're supposed to have John's name on here hey guys my buddy's name's supposed to be on here I better check and see if it is Johnny's, where'd you say it was? Oh, there it is. He's All hit. right, I can see it. Is it right about here? <laughs> we got his name put on here. John Hoagie. He's our man. Hope, your, hope his daughters are happy with what we've done for him. I'm sad. That's all I want to say about that. Well, we ended up going to One-Eyed Jack's after we'd done full throttle, broken spoke, and uh, iron horse. Now, this place has got a lot of women in it, good-looking women. And uh, the thing is, I can't record in there with a video camera very well. They play lots of good music have uh, I think two bands they also have some dancers upstairs that uh, a lady by the name of Vanilla Dog runs that part of the show Got you a sticker in there last time, didn't you? All right, okay, where, where are you from? Medicine Hat over to Canada. I didn't know they had a Medicine Hat up there, also. Yeah, yeah the one down here we were going to go to. Too far to walk. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. And you're down, how long are you down here for? I go back to on Tuesday morning. Got it. What was yeah. your name again? Yeah. Dan? Yeah. Do you have a last name or a yeah, name? Yeah, Nip Nipstrom. 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 Never heard of that. <laughs> 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 
real. <laughs> there ain't many of us. Yeah. That's three of me. And you're getting ready to sign up on my channel. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Well, it was a pleasure meeting you, sir. I was just hearing about you. Yeah. But, yeah, they're good videos. I'm trying to make them that way. Yeah, I've been putting, putting a, a little two-minute one on every day here. Over here. <laughs> it's this track. It's the site. Well, you guys stay tuned. His name. Thank you. Adam Mark. Adam Mark. Yeah. Yep. From outside of Detroit, Michigan. There you go. All right. Thank you. Yeah. I'll see you. Thank you. Well, here we are. Legendary. Glen number 10. We're going to go up there and eat. In that restaurant. See if we can get a salad or something healthy. Retard to Greece. Retard to Greece. Run up there and see what they got. You ready? Back in 1993, you could come in the back door on your motorcycle and ride through the bar. But you had to stop right there because if you dare stick your front tire out on the sidewalk, it was a $1,000 fine then. But they didn't care if you did that, and then you just pushed your bike out. You didn't drive it, you pushed it. Yeah, I've been coming a long time. You guys remember this girl from last year? She massaged the seat on my motorcycle. Yes, you did. Wax what? on, wax off. How was the bike like seat work for you? Good. Then I ripped it, but it's still good. And uh, I uh, appreciate your work last year. Thank you. And uh, too bad my buddy ain't here because he was in love with you. He, he drank too much. Oh, I can't wait to show him this video and show him what he missed because he's in the tent. Oh, oh, this is where I am all day today. All right. You seen that, Spanky? You missed yes, it. Yes, Spanky. Uh-huh. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Well, we made it to the front door. Finally. And they're not playing music, so I can actually videotape. But more vendors and vendors and vendors. They are everywhere. I mean, they go all the way down there. 10.43 on your Saturday, Sunday, round day. 10.43. Yep, you want it. You can buy it here. Ain't that right? Yeah, you can get free belt buckles last year here, too. Yeah, let's see if we get more. Yeah. Yep, we're inside now. They have beautiful girls here waiting on people. And lots of merchandise. Just through there, just oh, that, yeah, you know, look everywhere with your head on. Hey, this is Dave. We got a picture in Walla Gova now. Let's get over here in the sun. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Out here in Joint Circus. Yeah. We need a better background, don't you think? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, there's sure. a background there right around there. There's yeah. a background. <laughs> nice background. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> so, where, where are you? Come up here, Dave. We uh, got enough kitties. <laughs> so where are you from, Dave? St. Joseph, Missouri. That's right. Yeah. I think you told me that. Yeah. My um, memory not very long. Uh, my, my, uh, my, uh, my, uh, did you find a good place to park? I did. Way down there. Yeah. Yeah. Where are you staying? Um, uh, in somebody's yard. In somebody's yard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do they know it? Yeah. Okay. So, and your daughter was in one of my videos. Uh, yeah. I don't tell anybody. Okay. <laughs> Wasn't his daughter. It was his girlfriend. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's nice to meet you, Dave. Nice to meet you. Can you get that? We just checked in here late. 
got here at uh, two thirty rather than one because I had a believe it or not somebody wanted to interview me. Who knows what it'll look like, but it's not going to be on uh, New York Times, something or other. I'll put a link on it whenever they do that. But we got here late, and uh, as soon as we did, they stopped the races because it was starting to sprinkle. Right after we paid our money, non-refundable, but I hear motors revving, so I think they're getting ready to go again. So let's watch the drag races. Not as hard, we're trying to hide from the rain. I found a place to hide. I don't know if you guys recognize this place or not. Kind of a little bit crappy. But anyway, I'm trying to stay dry. Those guys are hibernating over there. Sturge's rains come and go, usually pretty rapidly. Hopefully. That road's gonna be treacherous out there because it's you can see how soaked and wet it is. Hopefully everybody slows down. Oh, wishes luck. Well, by the time you see this, you'll know we made it. We're at Hog Heaven, and I just ran into... Steve Collins from Indy, representing Indiana. Yes, he is. He's one of uh, my subscribers. And you, what'd you say? You watched the one packing or something? Or which one got you no, there? I just I, I watched the one where he's giving uh, your uh, critique on Hog Heaven, and so that's where I wound up. Yeah. It's a nice and place. And it's a thumbs up. Yeah, yeah. I like it. Yeah. I like it. How long are you going to be here for? Needed the advice. I'm staying until Friday morning, probably. Are you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. When are you coming back? Next year. Are you next year? Oh, yeah. It's my first we got year. we got a phone to a bomber behind us here. Yeah, the uh, 
the the roads up here and and the scenery is just you can, oh yeah it's indescribable yeah I don't videos don't do it any justice no I don't want I I don't I got it I don't want to sit in the sit in sit in a bar I can sit in a bar at home yeah these roads like you said and, and concerts and, and all uh, races know, drag roads. races circle tracks and circle tracks are yeah, pretty awesome yeah I want I want to see if I can check one of them out there's some others not too I within there's a hill climbs too. When's that? You know. Ah, uh, when was that? You know. I then had it. today or tomorrow. If you yeah, if I you just go to, go down, down here to the road and turn right, it's just right around the corner. It's got a poster to tell you. Them I'll are pretty checking. cool. Yeah. 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 So but anyway, I appreciate all your advice. Uh, you know, a little bit of uh, uh, internet advice, and you give some good advice. So, I, I try you know, to. On, and on if I and if I don't and... know the real shit, I'll make it up. <laughs> 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 My wife says that all the time. Yeah. Well, I'm glad to meet you, man. Appreciate it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You guys have a safe trip home. You too. Yeah. The bikes are fired up, warming up. We're leaving a little later than we wanted to leave, so we don't know how far we'll get. But uh, this is last from Hog Heaven this year well the roads right up there this is the campsite it's pretty nice it could use some watering but the tent sites are big enough we can put uh, three tents in one spot we got the showers and the bathroom bathrooms right across the way here parking right there that's more handy than most places we had a nice uh, dinner there at the cowboy uh, restaurant they always have good food and too expensive. You got to stop in if you're going through Du Bois and you're hungry. This would be a good place for you to stop if you want to uh, need a place to camp. They got cabins, uh, RV spots, tent spots naturally. Well, good morning, everybody. We're still in Du Bois. We're having breakfast before we take off. And uh, back at the Cowboy restaurant. We like it there. We got a late start because it is going to be cold over the pass here. I don't know how much recording we will do from this point on. You've seen most of it. This pass takes us over, end up in Jackson Hole, and on over into Idaho and home. So that we've already filmed all that. Battery's about dead on the other camera because didn't have a place to charge it up last night. The place we stayed at last night was pretty good. It was noisy with cars, though, with people slamming their doors and honking their horns and locking their doors. Couldn't believe that. But uh, it's a good place to stay. I'd stay there over the KOA anytime. Matter of fact, I won't ever stay at the KOA again. I've had a lot of problems with KOAs. I'm bigger than they think they're too big for their britches. But I had a pretty good time, and I had a great time meeting all you guys out there at Sturgis. And. Uh, I am amazed at how many of you are following my adventure. I hope I've kept it kind of entertaining. And uh, keep following. Y'all have a good day. We'll see you when we get back. We had a good time, and I figure this video is long enough. A little of this, a little of that. Maybe something you will want to see when you're there. Hey, yeah, that's me right there. Bye. See you when we get back.